So today, guys, we bring you the first ever logging wagon go kart thing on with a motorhome. So we have our little gas jug that puts the gas in the motor that makes it run. Then we got this special, you'll think, for special purposes that doesn't have to do, definitely doesn't have to do with any of this. So we got our GoPro out because we're probably going to go mudding with it. Fully built, three and a half inch lift kit on the front with track bars, you know, all that cool stuff. And you got the just really well done front end suspension. Uh, it's also like got a solid 10 inch lift in the back with the uh, little tires. And then we got the nice little go-kart chain pretty tight. And we got our three and a half inch straight pipe all the way back. And this gas line is for the, uh, I just keep the exhaust cool. That way it doesn't like, you know, catch on fire or anything. And we also got our high quality seat that come from, I don't know. I think uh, Country Mart, but anyways. So this thing, I don't know, We it took seven days. Me and my brother built this thing in seven days. This was built out of a door hinge and this is just a gas pedal. I don't know where we got it. It was on another go-kart build. Um, and then we got our uh, steering bracket to hold the steering. That way it stays in place. Um, hopefully none of this fails while we're doing the video. But uh, we got our GoPro up here so you'll be able to see me when I'm sitting up here grabbing this thing from the mud hole, but for now, Let's take her down to the mud hole and see if she can handle on mud. Take it out of the mud hole. That dude, that dude in that sprayer, he is wicked fast. I don't know what the heck his deal was. But we're gonna head on down to the mud hole. I'll see you guys down there. I'm gonna drive that little buddy down there. We'll be back. Well, this is our mud hole that we're going to be driving it through. Now this, you make it thinking, it looks pretty big. You sure you wanna drive through that? Well. This is actually like a really small mud hole compared to what I've been driving my like uh, like four wheeler through. Like I've been like getting it where it would almost float. So this is a very small mud. I'm just kidding. We're not gonna go through that mud hole because that thing will go under about three times. So this thing is actually the mud hole we're gonna be driving through. It's actually like, you know pretty pretty soft right through right when you get about there, which I don't necessarily want to walk out there because well, I don't want to get my pretty gorilla cart dirty. But we're gonna try to drive that thing through there. How long it's gonna last driving through mud? I don't know. It could last a long time or it could last one pass through there. But I'm thinking about if we don't get stuck in here, you know it drives pretty good in here. I may full send it off that little bank and then I'll probably flip it, but let's hope we don't flip it. All right, I'm gonna get set up. We'll get the thing over here. Then I'm gonna rip it through the mud hole. Let's do it.
told you that wasn't good. Anyways, guys, I think we've done enough damage to this thing for today. I think we're going to pull it out of the mud hole. And, uh, and I think we're just going to, you know, we'll make another video on it sometime. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I'm debating on getting a little, a little diesel engine for it because that one doesn't have no torque. I know. I think this point, y'all guys, because it has not enough torque. And that's the problem because, well, it's made in, I don't know. It's made in America, uh, 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 okay, it's made in America with global parts, let's just say that. Uh, the car was from China, the battery was from China, the pump was from China, the motor's from Japan. But anyways guys, thanks for watching, and uh, if you like the video, like it. Uh, anyways, this thing is, I don't know, it's kind of good and kind of bad, it kind of doesn't work right now. But we will fix it, we'll make it better, maybe. I don't know. If you want to see more videos like this, comment below, and uh, we'll make more videos like this. Like, I'm hoping this goes like viral in like two days, but it may not. I'm just saying. But we better get the tow. We can pull this thing out because I have a feeling it's gonna be a. We got a long night ahead of us. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Man, that was a waste of thirty grand.